Okay, so today we're going to be reviewing the latest recast build for Android Lollipop. And so, again, you wouldn't be able to play any of these games on the previous build if you're on Lollipop. You have to have the recent one designed for Lollipop. So, you know, we go into settings here, kind of the same, you know, file path stuff, traditional settings that you normally have. Look, but check out all the BIOS settings you have here. I mean, how, how super user intuitive is that? I mean, that's really cool. That's really neat. So if you have a certain ROM that you can only play in a certain region, they pretty much make it easy to switch between the you know the different re BIOS regions there. Super cool. Now, kind of scrolling down, you'll see more familiar settings here, but then you also come to some experimental settings. Look at more familiar settings, GPU, etc. But look at this. You can change the cable type here. How cool is that? You, the, the type of signal that the, you know, that your the hardware would send out, right? You can actually change that. So it's super neat. Cha again, another DC uh, Dreamcast region options that you can change. PVR rendering, all that stuff. It's really user intuitive. It's really great. And the, I also noticed it's a lot more user intuitive to uh, in terms of the input settings as well. And specifically, I had my Bluetooth controller I used. Um, it was really easy to kind of set all that up and get all that going. So I was easy. I was you know quickly able to play all my games. I think the the most exciting part about this build was the, however is the cloud VMU in which you can simply save you know your files your save game data upload it to a cloud and you're good to go and it's really neat so you don't have to worry about saving it to like an SD card or something mini SD card USB stick via an OTG cable no you just simply upload it to the cloud super cool guys again I really like this build I'm disappointed that a few glitches haven't been resolved specifically in skies of Arcadia and uh, I was also informed of a, of a game of Sonic the Hedgehog, which was running a little choppy uh, on this build as well. But, it, but those are, you know, problems that have been kind of plaguing the recast for quite some time now. I kind of wish they, they would get resolved soon, though. I think a lot of us in the Android community are getting a little impatient by that. Um, I know Skies of Arcadia, I forget what the glitch specifically was. I know it had to do with the game, you know, I think randomly freezing or rebooting or something like that. Um, and then I know in Sonic it was just running choppy. So hopefully that will be resolved in the next version. Again, this project is imperfect, as I've said in previous videos, but they are making progress. Oh, yeah, and you can also take snapshots, too, while in the emulator itself, which is super cool. And I'm sure they're working on video and that kind of thing, too, So on video capture. So anyway, I really uh, would encourage you guys to go check that out, especially if you just upgraded your latest Android device to Lollipop. Really, really encourage you to go do that, guys, if you want to keep playing your Dreamcast games. So that'll be all for now. Please stay tuned for more great recast videos to follow. So long.